So welcome back to my channel. Today is Wednesday, which means that we have Top 5 Wednesday coming at you. And today's topic is books to give blank as gift. And for me, my blank is going to be someone who wants to get into biographies or someone who likes biographies. So I have five biographies here or autobiographies that I've really enjoyed this year. So yeah, it was not their suggestion, but we rolling with it. So I'm going to start with like my least favorite and then go to my favorite. And so the first book that I would recommend to someone who loves biographies is called The Midwife by Jennifer Wirth. A memoir of birth, joy, and hard times. It's also the book that the miniseries is based off of, so if you know someone who likes the miniseries, it might also be great. And it just follows these midwives around London in the poorer neighborhoods, sees what it's like, and I absolutely adored this book. Next, we have Musicophilia, Tales of Music and the Brain by Oliver Sacks. Oliver Sacks is a very popular writer and this is all about music and how we think about music and how music plays a role in our lives and how different, you know, mental disorders can have associations with music. I read this for a class and it was probably one of the best books that I've ever read for a class and I really enjoyed it. His stories in it are just so great and he's a phenomenal writer. So this would be a book for someone in your life that likes biographies. Next, I have Something Fierce, Memoirs of a Revolutionary Daughter by Carmen Aguera. I read this last year and it was so fantastic. I did not know very much at all about uh, the revolutions in Chile before I read this book. Carmen Aguera is Chilean and Canadian. She, you know, came here as a refugee during the Chilean coup and it just talks about her childhood and what it's like growing up in that situation and all that sort of stuff. It is a fantastic read and I would highly, highly, highly recommend it. Next I have Testament of Youth by Vera Britton. This is a chunkier one and it follows Vera Britton and her experiences during the First World War um, as a young person. She is really smart, she wanted to go to university and all these sort of things and her, a lot of her dreams got put on hold when the war broke out and she became a nurse and I mean like it's not really a spoiler but like everyone that she loves dies in the book so you get to see her dealing with grief and things like that as well and it's absolutely phenomenal, one of the best autobiographies I've ever read. And finally the last book that I'd recommend to the, for, as a gift for the person in your life who loves biographies is As You Wish. The Inconceivable Tales of the Making of the Princess Bride by Carrie Ulls. This is a really, really wonderful book. If you love The Princess Bride or have someone in your life that loves The Princess Bride, get them this book. It is so fantastic and I loved it. I absolutely loved it. It was by far one of the best uh, biographies that I've read and I was really nervous going into it because no. Carrie, love him as an actor, he's an author, he's a writer, so I wasn't sure how this one was going to work out, but it did work out really, really well. And I would highly recommend this. So those are the five books that I would recommend to someone who's in your life that loves biographies. They're all really great, they all bring something a little bit different to the table, and they're all kind of about different periods of time and different situations. So hopefully there's something in this list for everybody on your list. But I hope you enjoyed this video. If you've read any of these books, let me know in the comment section below. And if you bought any of them for family members, also let me know that. I would love to know if I have helped you pick out a book. But thanks for watching. I'll see you tomorrow in Vlogmas.